Good morning, Paul here from Interesting Places. I'm back in Blackpool, well just on the outskirts of Blackpool. I'm in Carlton Cemetery and Crematorium. I'm looking for the final resting place of an actress, a singer and a television personality. I'm looking for the final resting place of Bernie Nolan, the lead singer of the Nolans. Bernadette Therese Nolan was born on the 17th of October 1960 in Dublin, County Dublin, Ireland. Bernadette Therese Nolan, known as Bernie, was an Irish actress, singer and television personality. Formerly lead vocalist of the Nolans. Bernie Nolan was the second youngest of siblings Anne, Brian, Denise, Maureen, Tommy, Linda and Colleen. She was raised in Blackpool, Lancashire. Nolan first acted as the cast member on the BBC Saturday morning children's show On the Waterfront. Critics positively reviewed her gift for comedy. The Nolan sisters and their music were a running gag on the show. And she was joined by her sisters for musical performances during at least one episode. Nolan left the group in 1994 to concentrate on her own acting career, which began with her 1993 performance in the stage play, The Devil Rides Out. In 2000, Nolan joined the cast of Channel 4 soap opera Brookside as Diane Murray after being noticed by Paul Marquis while starring in the play Blood Brothers. She left in 2002 to play Sheila Murphy in ITV's police drama series, The Bill. In 2006, Nolan took part in Channel 4's series, The Games, ranking last in the females category. Her stint on the game was to raise money for charity, including Alzheimer's and children's charities. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. It's absolutely free and hit that notification bell that will keep you up to date with any future videos that are coming your way. Well, that leaves me time to show you the final resting place of Bernadette Therese Nolan, better known to you and I as Bernie Nolan. It was revealed on the 23rd of April 2010 that Nolan was suffering from breast cancer, which had spread to her lymph nodes. In October 2010, she stated that she was cancer-free after undergoing chemotherapy and a mastectomy. At the end of October 2012, Bernie announced that the cancer had returned and was incurable. Bernadette Nolan died from cancer in her sleep at her home in Surrey on the 4th of July 2013, aged 52. Precious memories of Bernadette Therese Danithi, Nee Nolan, 17th of October. 1960 to the 4th of July 2013. Loved and adored by family and friends, the most wonderful mother in the world to Erin, cherished by her husband Steve, you lit up our lives Bernie, we we'll love you for eternity my beautiful girl. Reunited with our daughter, Kate, born asleep on the 4th of May, 
Well, that brings me to a close for another video. From me, Paul, at Interesting Places, here at Carlton Cemetery and Crematorium. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.